Hey guys, um, I want to show a little sequence here. Uh, when your opponent's kind of crushing your Z guard, uh, setting up like a choke. This is a good little option for you guys. So, you're in Z guard, and your opponent gets this over wrap grip, a chin strap on your neck. Hey guys, don't panic here. I'm already under her base. So first I'm going to secure the far leg, elbow deep, not wrist deep, and a gable grip. Okay guys, so she can't get away from me. Now I'm going to take this outside foot, outside leg, sorry, and bring it foot first, not knee first, but foot first into a butterfly hook. Okay? Now this next motion, half of it is a pull and half of it is me putting myself on my back. Okay? So I'm going to put the side of my foot here and I'm going to bring myself under as I pull on top. From here she has two options. Okay? If she doesn't hide the heel and she opts to run when I attack the outside heel, so see she turns, she exposes this heel. I latch up the outside heel and she rolls. I stay with her. Stay with my knees pointed this direction, hands close to my head, I finish the heel hook. Okay, guys? Uh, the more advanced people get to this position, the more advanced people are going to step and turn their heel in so that you can't attack it, okay? So from here, guys, if she has good base, she's off her hands, I'm going to step on the ground and bump her forward. Put waiting on her hands, okay? I'm going to keep this frame up, and I'm going to go under for reverse X. Now I lift my knees and my chest because the leg's light. Don't move this leg, but straighten this one out and catch the far leg. Now you're in 411. It's an easy thing now to separate and get your inside heel hook. Hey guys, so one more time. The initial setup is the same for both. I'm here, they get my, a hold on my head, and I come in and secure the far leg with the gable grip. Remember guys, elbow deep, not wrist deep, okay guys? Here, this leg shoots out your top leg and comes in foot first, okay, for a butterfly hook, all right? Now the side of my foot's gonna drag my body flat under her as I pull my hands to my chest, okay? Boom. Once you're here, guys, you switch to a scoop grip, frame, frame with your knee, and bring your foot into single leg X or Ashi position, okay, guys? If they turn this way or they keep their foot out, it's an easy outside heel hook grip. To alleviate pressure, she's gonna have to roll. When she does, I stick with her. My knees stay pointed away from her. That, that top knee's gonna really pin the hip. I keep myself low. Heel hook, okay guys? If they give me the other option, where I'm here, she comes over, I get the grip, under, same setup, frame, 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 and she turns her foot in, okay? But she's heavy on her, on her base. I need this back leg to be light, okay? So I'm gonna step on the ground and bump her forward with my foot. That puts weight on her hands, okay? Now the same frame comes in, my foot goes under. This foot comes to the same side thigh. Now I bring both of my knees to my chest, Get that leg up, in the way, sorry, leg up in the air. I assist the grip and straighten this leg out. Dump her into the 411 again. Then from here, we gotta finish this from the inside heel look. Hey guys, appreciate you guys watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment for more. Uh, anything else you guys want. Hey guys, good to see y'all. Holy girl.